quite as much as she usually does, especially on that backhand side. Oh, <laughs> quick hands. Very quick. Fastest hands in the West on that one. <laughs> Two plus. Sitting the deal. Yeah, I think Sherbini creating so much along that backhand side. She's so accurate. Oh, my goodness. It's a trademark Sherbini backhand drop. And out. So deep Four in the court. Three. He's so short. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's lovely. We're starting to see Shabini just. Shifting the pieces on the board, she's spending more time in the middle now, and Abbas is not getting too much of a look around the front to use her speed. This was quite wondrous. Aussie bias, call it what you want. Oh, that's what goodness. happens. That's what happens. Too low. You haven't seen this film. Oh, that was ridiculous. Three, five. Look at this. Now Shabini's turn to take control of the middle. This is some of the skills that El Shabini possesses behind the back. Pretty. Made to look easy. Definitely not happy with where she is. I think she's always a player that is very process driven. Whether those results come for her or not in this phase of her career, I think she wants to be a better player than she was 12 months ago. And that's probably more important to her than those wins. Oh, oh my goodness yeah. gracious me. Two extremes, the power there, and then the beautiful feathering in. Look at that.